All right, so I'm back. I took a little break from recording and, and editing and even uploading, um, but I'm back now. Last game of the regular season going up against the Los Angeles Clippers. We are at home in the last game of the regular season. We're going up against the Clippers, like I said, we are in the first seed as of right now. Even if we lose this game or win, we're still going to be in the first seed, which means we're going up against the eighth seed, which is the Timberwolves in the first round of the playoffs. And I already recorded the whole entire playoffs. And I'm not going to spoil anything. But I'm a, all I'm going to say is it gets real interesting. But anyway, I wanted to keep it realistic when it comes to my stats. Anybody can drop 40. Anybody can drop 10 rebounds, 10 assists a game, average a double-double. But can you keep it realistic and still make it to the first seed? That's harder than just balling out by yourself. But anyway, enough talking. Let's get into the last game of the regular season. All right, so we're at home once again. We're in Portland. We got to win this game just for the crowd, the home crowd. We got to end this game off or the season off right just for the home crowd. As I'm dunking on that boy, Blake Griffey. Your name is Blake Griffey until I say otherwise, damn it. As this boy Chris Paul trying to play defense on me, I put him in the post. He's too small. Post for the way jump shot to the right as I'm knocking that shot down. My first jumper of the game. And once again, man, they just keep testing me. I'm going to put Jamal Crawford in the post this time. Backing him down. Post for the way jump shot to the left this time. And I knock that down. My second jumper of tonight's game is 7-9. And look at that boy Blake Griffey trying to show out for the crowd. My crowd at that. And he doesn't get it to go as I'm getting the ball pump faking stepping back pulling up bang let's go just in case y'all didn't see that because of the little scoreboard was in the way for my mom player here you go I caught Jamison with the pump fake then somebody tried to come play defense and got splashed on shout outs to my brother YG you need to come back dog as I get my first dime right there dishing it down to that boy LA in the paint and we had a lead, but they cut the lead down, so we're only up by three points. As I'm eating off the glass, getting a defensive rebound, bringing the ball down the court, hitting the crossover, going out with a reverse dunk. Instagram, Instagram not dunk. Not dunk. Not dunk. Finally, all this time I've been trying to do this one dunk and I finally get it in the last game of the regular season. About damn time. Three seconds left in the first quarter. I'm stopping at the left wing, pulling up, and I missed the buzzer beater. So we're going into the second quarter up by five points. And to start off the second quarter, this is the only highlight I had in the second quarter. I get the ball from LA, step back, I pass it off to LA, and I go ahead and pick up another assist. That was the only highlight in the second quarter. As you see, we go straight to the third quarter. I mean, hey, I was trying to get some dimes, and it just wasn't working for the entire second quarter. As I stop, go ahead and dish it off to that boy T. Rob, my right-hand man on this Trailblazers team, and I pick up my third assist, my third dime. As I'm trying to cross this boy over, couldn't really find nothing, so I'm stepping back, resetting, waiting for the shot clock to start winding down. Two seconds left. I pull up for the simple mid-range jump shot over at the left corner. You know, you ain't got to do stuff fancy all the time. Pull up for the simple jump shot and, and keep it moving. As I'm putting this boy in the post, as I'm hitting him with the post fadeaway jump shot to the left, and that's in there for two points. I've been working on that for a couple of weeks now, and I think I got it down packed. Five seconds left. You know I want this buzzer beater badly to end the third quarter. I'm getting pushed, getting bump pulling up and that's not in there that's a miss so we have a two-point lead going into the fourth quarter which is starting right now and now we're down by two points you know i'm not liking that i got this bum jared deli on me i'm stepping back pulling up and that's wet like water you better play that defense man because if not i'm gonna be draining these threes all on the court dripping and drop all on the court stepping back pulling up B damn I thought I had the juice, but I didn't. I missed the shot. I was about to start heating up. I was about to have that juice. And look at 2K with the bumping animation. I bumped Vince Carter. He went to the swipe, swipe animation. Step back and let Jamal Crawford knock down a three. I mean, damn it. Come on now. Jamal Crawford, get that out of here, boy. As I'm getting a block, cleaning up the mess in my paint. 
We're down by one point. T Rob setting the screen, cutting to the basket as he get the one hand jam right there, giving us a one point lead, 50 to 51. The Clippers are down by one, but turn that around. Blake Griffin with the layup, and he has the lead. They have the lead now by one point. We are down by one point, a one point deficit as I come down and pull up for the deep mid range shot right there, giving us a one point lead, but. Uh, we just cannot hold on to the lead as we're down by three and go ahead and make that five points. I don't even know who that is. I think Hollins or something like that. He made the layup. So now we're down by five points. You know I want the ball in my hands. You know I'm looking for that three. And really, 2K, really, I get hit. I'm trying to step back a little bit. I get bumped, and he just stepped back like five times. Are you serious right now? As I go ahead and get the steal on Blake Griffin, I'm calling for the ball. And you know what, Damian Lillard? Fuck you, man. I had to call a timeout because you want to be a little ball hogging bastard. You don't do nothing for this team. You average like six points a game, dog. I pass it to you. You never shoot. Like, he just wanted the ball hog, so I call a timeout on his big dumb ass. As I come back and knock down a three, this is what I could have did if he didn't ball hog. Like, come on now. As we're down by two, I'm trying to cross over. Going ahead and tying this game up with the layup right there. 58 to 58. 28.2 seconds left. We could have had the lead if Damian Lillard would have passed the ball at the right time. But look at this play right here. Six seconds left. Three seconds left. Look at this. I go into the left. Oh, my God. Why would you make me lay the ball up left-handed when he's on my left side? And to add to that, I had the right stick pointing at the right direction so he would do a right hand layup. I know what I'm doing, but 2K love the troll. So I start the overtime on the bench, right? And I end the overtime on the bench. And we lose. Yeah, we lost. Last game of the regular season, we lost. Thanks, 2K. Love trolling. They just love trolling, don't they? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Anyway, Hall of Fame verification, and that's not it. Um, I got some more little uh, info to tell y'all. We're going against the Timberwolves in the first seed. Y'all already know that. But, um, yeah, 2K, 2K, 2K. I know you're wondering, like, who's the MVP? Who's the Rookie of the Year? Who's the MIP, Most, invite, uh, most Improved Player? Coach of the Year, MVP, MIP, Sixth Man of the Year. Yeah, 2K don't show none of that. None. None. Well, actually, they showed two. Six man of the year and rookie of the year. That's a damn shame. The end of the regular season, you're supposed to show the awards for rookie of the year. As you see, I got that. And if you look up top, that's Gallinari. So Gallinari won the six man of the year. I'm looking everywhere to find these awards. They only showed two awards. Coach, not coach of the year, uh... Rookie of the year and um, six man of the year. Where's the coach of the year? Where's the MVP? Where's the MIP? Where's the all defensive team? Where's the like really 2K? And after in the once I once again I completed the playoffs. The playoffs is done. I'm not spoiling anything. I'm not telling you if we won it all or if we lost. But after the playoffs, they didn't show no awards either. So I don't know who's the MVP of the finals. I don't know who's the MVP of the regular season. I don't know who's the MIP. I don't know who's the coach of the year. Really, 2K? That's what we doing? Really? And y'all act like 2K is just the perfect... You know what? I'm not even going to start raging on the game. 2K good, but it also have a lot of bad things about it, as well as NBA Live 14. Stop acting like these games are perfect, man. That's all I got to say. Stay tuned for my next video. Make sure y'all thumbs up. Make sure y'all drop a comment. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And um, I'm out. Peace.